boys and girls in Mrs. Elliott's class, we've had a fantastic day today. It's time to take your folders out. Oh, I'll talk to you about the AR test tomorrow. And color in what color you're on for behavior. Is it green, yellow, hopefully no oranges, no reds, thank goodness. Anybody be at the cubbies right now? No. no. There's only one person right there that is not following my directions. Oh, you better get it out then. <coughs> okay, make sure all those crayons are put away nice and neat. And stand behind your desk. And you notice how, Mr. Swanson, you notice how they are standing right behind their desk. First time I asked them to, even at a busy time. Great. Group one, go get ready to go home. Group one. I only hear one person's voice right now. And I noticed right here on our champs chart... There should be no voices on right now. Okay, group two, go ahead and get yourself packed up and ready to go home. Have a fabulous, fabulous afternoon. Group three can go. Okay, we don't need to tell our neighbors about our lunch boxes, thank you. Yes, there's a quite a few lunch boxes over here. Make sure you find yours. Only take yours, remember. Let everybody be responsible for their own self. I have a bet with my friend who's a teacher of teenagers. He said he has to tell his kids seven times what to do in his class. I said, let's just trade school the first time. So we're having a bet. <laughs> you know what a bet is? Oh, Mr. Swanson, you are going to be so impressed that first graders can follow directions the first time. <laughs> I'll I'll show you guys tomorrow. That's nice, Eric. <laughs> All right, have a fabulous, fabulous afternoon, everyone. If you go out the front door, you may walk out the front door. See you tomorrow. Bye. Hey, Isaiah. Um, your mom's going to meet me right here, okay? So why don't you just go see if she's in the hall? I don't think so. Did they say bus lineup was in the gym? I don't think so. I didn't think so either. All right, I'm going to turn this off here.